Don't cut yourself, Paul. Wouldn't that be terrible if, like, I brought back a bloody cell? <laughs> It's PJ and today we have an unboxing and it's a really good one. It's my favorite. You know what? Because it's a Sabbath box. Yay! I think. I hope that's what that is. So uh, let's get our knife out and yeah, let's try and figure this one out. So, yep, it's the Sabbath box. Oh my gosh, and I, I'm opening this with you. It says, The Witch's Sabbath. And it's black. Look at this. Oh, the purple little... Ooh, I'm excited. Okay, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Okay. Oh my God, this one is full, by the way. Okay, the first thing we're getting is... Vampire blood incense. Now, I've never smelled this kind of incense because, honestly, don't know what vampire blood smells like. Oh, my God. It smells like heaven. Oh, my God. This is probably the most, it's, like, really earthy. But, like, at the same time, you know the candles that I love the best? What are they called? Like, that's Moonlight. I love that. And not the one burning, the one above it. And um, uh, Cashmere or uh, that Teakwood one. Uh, uh, that's what this smells like. This will be witches. I'm loving it. Oh, my God. Are you getting high off and thinking about this? I am. God, I need glasses. Okay. So, we got the um, incense, which is the Vampire Blood Incense, and it's organic hand-rolled incense, and the name is a little bit of like a campy name, but they got it. It's made from a rare blend of herbs, flowers, and resins to create this heavenly, heavenly smell. Love it. Um, and it's just incense. It doesn't have a man magical connotation other than, you know, incense, air, that kind of thing. Okay, two. We got the Protection uh, Black Ritual Tapers. So we got a candle with a protection ritual, which we will do together. And, uh, yeah, so it's just for witches. That's what it says. So badass. Next, let's see what we let's pull something out. It is, it looks like an essential oil, and it says spirit of let me look it up on here. It's very hard to read because it's all tiny tiny. So hold on. It's an oil and it is spirit of Samhan Sabbath oil. Okay, they chose it because it's a ritual oil. That will make a very big addition to your Samhain, Hain? Samhain, rites and rituals and spells. All Hallows Eve is what I'm thinking this is for. So this is a beautiful herb oil. Um, each oil is handcrafted. Oh, honoring the, the dead. This is to honor the ones past. Oh, you know I'll use this. Because I have lots of that in my life. I have a lot of past people and I spend lots of my time trying to talk to them. Yeah, so I'm a little strange. But um, so that is this oil. This oil helps. So let's do like a candle ritual and invoke our past loved ones to come and give us signs. And we'll do that together on here. Almost like, I don't know, a kind of mini seance type thing, but not a seance. I think that's so can't be. We'll just try to get them to come through the veil, you know, on um, Halloween or um, Day of the Dead, all that. That is all when, mostly it's when the veil between us and them are very thin. So visits and whatnot are really easier. So you know I'm going to be meditating. I'm going to try to astral project my ass right into Jeff's lap and uh, anybody else who'd like to see me like my dad or whatnot. But yeah, so oh, I love it. 
and this is to help me get there. <laughs> I love you, Sabbath Box, so much. Like, I've had more fun with this than anything else. This is salt. And I don't know if I've impressed upon you enough how important salt is. I almost use it in every ritual. Um, and this is consecrated uh, black salt. And it is, black salt is energetically charged and consecrated, making it a useful magic correspondent for protection and banishing. And I've gone through my protection spells with you before where I put sea salt or kosher salt, either or, in buckets by my door in some water, uh, hopefully water that's been blessed or spring water, or river water, or thunder water, which is water from thunderstorms, which I have buckets outside because I collect this shit. And you, I also put it on all my windowsills. Now, I've not used black salt, but I use, like I said, kosher salt and whatnot to keep people from breaking in, basically, and being able to hurt me. So, black salt, I'm like, excited! There is nothing I don't love about this. Okay, oh my gosh, old-fashioned gypsy cards. How crazy is that? Oh my god. One day I'll show you my tarot card collection. I literally have probably 20 decks. And it's so funny because I basically use my uh, voodoo ones or just a Rider weight. Uh, but these are cool. Um, I can't wait. My girlfriend reads regular cards. She never, ever transferred her name is dale and she lives in florida and she is an amazing psychic and um she reads regular uh playing cards she never went to tarot cards she um always read cards like uh since she was like a little girl so it's crazy like she would love these i mean i might buy you know you can everything i show you on sabbath box all this stuff you can go on their website and buy if you like it uh you don't have to get the whole box you can just pick like one thing out that you particularly thought was cool and go ahead and buy it and they i'm sure they would appreciate it. i wish i had a code for you because a lot of times if you can get a code it's cheaper for you. I think I'm going to write them and ask and see if I can get a coupon code for like 10% for you guys. That would be so cool. Or for me, because I pay for this. But I don't mind paying for it. I love the box. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Okay, what's next? Oh, they gave me some black sage mugwort. So I have another smudge stick, which is so nice. Let's see, we're getting down. Oh, and look at the black worms. We got black worms. I mean, the inside of the box is all black. Isn't that beautiful? And so the next they gave me, I think it's a piece of onyx, but let's read. Obsidian. Obsidian. It is a tumbled gemstone crystal, and it's from Azure Green. I, I That's the place you get it from. They chose it because it is um, occurring in volcanic glass. Oh, it's volcanic glass. Do you see it? It's really pretty. It feels really good when you hold it, too. There is a natural vibration to it. Um, what, this is hot lava comes in contact with water and is rapidly cool, forming this powerful stone with a deep, dark color. Black os... I'm, I'm hoping I'm saying this right. Ab... Obsidian. Obsidian is, is said to provide strong psychic protection and shields against negative energy. It also is a great stone for for grounding. Wow! It aids in the divination and channeling. Wow! Making it a stone for... So I guess that... So let's, without going into it, this um, Sabbath, the Samhain is the parting of the veil. Oh my gosh, I didn't even read this. You saw me over again. Like, right now, the veil is so thin that um, it, you should be able to contact people very easily. So, that being said, all this box is about that. I, oh wait. Oh, you get all your little coupons. See, I got my coupons. What's that? Yep. 
This is a coupon for all their little shops that are connected to them. Moonlight Herbals, The Witchery and Company. So you get coupons in the box. You should really get these boxes if you can. Oh, wait. Oh, that's so cute. They gave me Halloween candy. Starbursties. And of course, my little chat book from, I'm sure it's from Llewellyn. Is that who it's from? I can't, yes. Llewellyn's and this is Sam Hain and it's rituals to get through the, the other side think this book won't be read in a matter of days um, I love her books they have beautiful illustrations in them uh, I, I just think she is look at this look at the illustration that looks like my house <laughs> Yeah, I live in a little old witchy looking cottage with lots of plants and crazy stuff so but this will have different ways for me to thin that veil so that I can pay homage and I pay homage every day to the ones that pass I of course um, I drink coffee with them and I put it into the ground and if you haven't seen my videos then you know, I just, I remember the face of my father. I remember the face of my relatives that left before me because that's why I'm here. I'm here to have this conversation with you because they were there. So um, I absolutely will read this book. I will use every single piece of this. This is a box made for me. And they have done so well by me, I can't tell you. Like, I just love them. I love their companies. I love what they do. Say hi, baby. There's Piper. Oh, this is a really good box. Can I put you down, baby? Can mommy put you down? I didn't see your face. They can't even see you with your heel. They outdo themselves. They care about every detail. They have yet to disappoint me with any of the things they sent. And uh, you need to go get yourself the Sabbath box. Start it now so that you can go through the wheel and get all the different Sabbaths coming. Uh, lots of ritual time coming up this week, next week. I can't wait. I think this is going to be a fun box to play with. Okay. All right, guys, that's all. Um, <laughs> I'm going to go play with all this stuff because it just feels like Christmas every time I get one of these boxes, I swear to you. So if you'd like to follow me down the rabbit hole that is my life, hit the button down below and subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. If you love these kind of videos, if you hate them, give them a thumbs down. Either way, got you watching. Manifest something good in your life, guys. If you know it, think it, believe it. You can have it. You can have your own Sabbath box. Yay! Look at all this stuff. I'm so happy. It's the witch box. And who am I if I am not the witch? <laughs> all right. Have a good night. Bye. I'm going to go play. Bye. 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 I'll record.